about statistics shows that Africa has like 60% of the world that is in that. So de definitely we're supposed to be producing for the rest of the for the rest of the world. But that's not really the case because like our total factor of productivity is actually below one. We operate in the agri-tech space. Okay. We are building uh, software for farmers so that they can be able to get access to their like, digital access to markets all across Africa. Okay. So with our software delivering uh, access to market, we want to inspire a lot of young people to actually get into agriculture because they know that there is actually market like, mm -hmm. like the risk can go to some extent and make it lucrative. A lot of tools that we actually like we are onboarded on the uh, Funder Hub platform and uh, we, uh, we are one of the Microsoft startups. In the AI aspect, uh, we've had several meetings with the uh, block team, looked at use cases and uh, we are working on like on like in fact we uh, we were able to discuss about uh, collection collecting of the data and, uh, and, ma and many other like developing like, right. uh, uh, AI into the system that we are currently using. Uh, post uh, flat mass, yes, yeah. we were able to uh, get grants from uh, Ministry of uh, EPR, Egypt Ministry of Information and Technology, and the grant has like post flat mass, the grant has really been helping us actually to actually scale right. uh, to scale. And uh, uh, with flat mass, still, we're also looking at uh, we are already talking with investors and looking at funders. We've been able to support about eight hundred. Or businesses, some of them are big business, some of them or ma majority of them are small businesses, retailers. Okay. So what we are doing, and we are actually keen with the Microsoft goal to of like reaching uh, millions of like uh, or, or, or SMEs. In, in the next one year, we're looking to work with five thousand farmers. Our current team, we are working with one thousand two hundred, and uh, we're also looking to expand our our farmer data, our farmer data base to northern Nigeria because. A lot of uh, the agriculture uh, product that we consume right. actually comes from there. We're also looking at the, uh, the operation. Then we're all looking to open distribution center too in like in uh, other regions. Currently, we serve five states in Nigeria in other regions where we're actually able to serve them.